If you guys want insanely cheap and reliable coins, make sure to check out UFIFA by using the link in the description. There's only around £6 per 1 million coins at the moment, so incredible, a great time to buy coins for the winter upgrades. And also make sure to use discount code PENGUIN5 to get 5% off all your purchases. Alright guys, and welcome back to yet again another FIFA 15 hybrid squad builder. And uh, as you all know, on Friday, winter upgrades will be getting released onto FIFA 15. So in preparation for that this week, I am going to be bringing out a lot of uh, squad builders, which do include players which are uh, most likely to get winter upgrades on Friday. So that's their informed cards, their base cards, just some incredible players due to be released onto the game. In this episode, uh, we've got one of the most highly anticipated in my opinion, that is Lacazette. But anyway guys, could drop a like on this video, smash 50 likes like you have been doing recently, that would be greatly appreciated, your support has been insane, remember every like is a penguin at home. But anyway, going straight into this squad and firstly, in goal we're starting off with another player that could actually potentially get upgraded, uh, more than likely is going to get an upgrade, that is De Gea. Of course starting off in the Premier League, Spanish nationality as well, age 3 rated overall, uh, really crucial for chemistry purposes, and moving up into our defence, firstly at right back we've got Debussy. Going into Arsenal then here, he has French nationality, again crucial for chemistry purposes. There really aren't too many good right backs uh, in the Premier League, but this guy is uh, really solid, even though he does only have 76 pace. And as the first centre back on the right hand side, we've got his teammate on a national and uh, international scale, that is Koscielny. One of the most overpowered centre backs on the game with 81 pace and 82 defending. And as the second centre back on the left hand side, we've got Piquet. Going into the Spanish league here, he plays for Barcelona. Unfortunately, not the quickest of players, only 6 6 pace, but nevertheless, does have 8 6 defending. Then also gets a super link for a uh, left back in this squad, that is Jordi Alba. Of course, 81 raced overall, uh, 92 pace, really is one of the quickest fullbacks on the game. High attacking work rates as well, means that he does get up and down the left flank very effectively. Also, 81 dribbling. Now, moving up into our uh, midfielders. Of course, they're off three in this formation, which is 4 3 2 1. Firstly, on the right hand side, we've got Matuidi. Going into the French League, age 3 rated overall, originally a defence midfielder, so you do need to convert him. Nevertheless, though, this high attacking and high defensive work rate perfect in this position, and also perfect in this squad for chemistry purposes. And as the second centre midfielder in the middle of the three, we've got Lorm. 8 7 rated overall, going into the Bundesliga, playing for Bayern Munich. High attacking and high defensive work rate, like Matuidi. Also, we have very good defensive abilities, being 87 rated. And as for our final midfielder, on left hand side, we have got Thiago. 81 rated, again for Bayern Munich. Also, Spanish nationality, getting linked both Pique and Alba. And they're really a very well balanced centre midfielder. Then going up into our forwards, firstly on the right hand side, we have got Lucas Moura. Probably one of my favourite uh, right wingers on the game. Perfect in this 4 3 2 1 formation. 93 pace and 87 dribbling. Really is very overpowered, managing to get quite a few goals. And as the other forward on the left hand side, we've got one of the highest rated players on the game, that is Frank Ribery. Gain, of course, playing for Bayern Munich. French nationality as well, crucial for county purposes. 89 pace and 92 dribbling. Really is an insane player. And then finally, for the striker and the main man of this squad, uh, the last player in the team, we've got Lacazette. Of course, definitely going to be getting an upgrade on Friday. This base card, though, 79 rated overall, still incredible, so it will be insane to see what his upgrade will be like. But nevertheless, uh, another great goal scorer in this team, managing to bang in a lot of goals, and uh, this team, I can assure you, will be insane with his upgrade uh, introduced onto the game. But anyway, guys, unfortunately, that does bring us to the end of this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to drop a like. I'd like to say at the start, if you could smash 50 likes on this video yet again, that would be greatly appreciated. Your support recently has been insane, guys. Really does mean a lot. So uh, thank you very much for that. And also, uh, make sure you do subscribe to this channel for more FIFA 15 videos.